folks, I've got a package to open from Amazon today because I'm doing an unboxing of an artificial nest with eggs. So I'll explain why I've got this in a min, but first I just want to say if you decide after watching this that you would like to purchase this item, I would be much obliged if you use the link below as it helps the channel. So the reason I've got this is for our powered bird swing project that we've made for Walker Squawker and I'll show you that later in the video. But first, let's get this unboxed. <laughs> the eggs are really cute. Cute in it. Really tiny. I wasn't sure if I was going to get white eggs or yellow eggs. So it must be just random. Because in the photographs, and some photographs they were white, and some they were yellow, and some they were mixed. But I've got three yellow eggs. The eggs are really realistic, as is the nest. I say they're realistic. They are on the top, but underneath they've got this this thing. I don't know what that is. Some it must have been in some part of the process of making it. So you need to sort of not see that bit. It looks like some injection moulding point. Mm. They like a uh, hollow plastic. They're very light. And the nest has got some sort of wire structure to hold it together. So let's get our walker squawk in and see how he fits in. Well, I don't know what you think, Paul, but I think that's pretty much mm. perfect. Mm, very good, yeah. That is so cute. Mm. So cute. Mm. And you can even perch him on top of the eggs, make them sit a bit higher up in the nest. This is the powered bird stand that Paul has made for our walker squawker and I want to put the nest just about here and it fits in perfectly it's just the right size so Paul we want to fix this into the bird stand permanently mm -hmm. and we're gonna have a look for something in the garage to use Maybe a sort of um, thin piece of bamboo. Yeah, yeah. Like those pieces that you put on the side of the swing. Mm. So, Paul, are you thinking of using some of these bamboo strips, maybe two? Mm -hmm. And you put a point on one there and you've managed to push it through. Yeah. So, you think that's going to work okay? Well, we'll try another one and see what it's like. Okay, so and how do you think you'll affix the ends? Two little blocks of wood, maybe. Little blocks of wood. Mm. So you've got the nest secured in, Paul. Yeah. And there's the little blocks on either side that have been glued to the bamboo strips. Mm. And that's what Walker Squawker looks like sitting in it. Paul made this powered bird swing because when Walker Squawker is attached to a magnet, Walker Squawker goes into singing mode. But to carry on singing, Walker Squawker has to continuously move. So that's why he's made the powered bird swing. So I put Walker Squawker on the swing, which means that Walker Squawker is attached to the magnet. And when we set this moving, he should start singing.
Well, the eggs aren't being thrown out the nest, so that's good. So this bird swing isn't completed yet. Paul needs to box in this area and to add a battery pack. Box the gears and the servo and the servo mounting in and the box containing the battery pack and the switch, yeah. It's very close to completion now though, isn't it? It is, yeah. Mm. I'm really pleased with this artificial nest and eggs. And I think it'll add the finishing touch when the stand's completed. Hope to bring you an update soon, folks, when it's all finished. But that's it for this video. Thanks for watching, as always. And see you next time.